after Devin Haney got that amazing win over Regis Progray, Shakur Stevenson was been kind of, uh, you know, lately for like the past week, he's been kind of quiet because a couple of weeks back, man, you know, <laughs> he's been heavily tweeting and, and digging himself into a deeper hole when it comes to his performance against um, Edwin De Los Santos a couple of weeks back. And now he had to drop his two cents on the Devin Haney win. You know, he didn't really congratulate him. At least I didn't see where he did. But he said, got to give Bill Goofy ass his credit. He a smart businessman. So what does Shakur mean by this? Uh, I look at it like he trying to say, well, uh, Regis Progray was a cherry pick. That's what I interpret that as. He's saying Regis is a cherry pick. Uh... Bill Haney knew to pick the right opponent for, for, for Devin Haney at that weight class. But well, let's check it out. Here's my thing. Regis was a belt holder, bro. He had a real title. It's not like Tank, where Tank fought, went up and fought Barrios for a fake Reggie title. He went there and stole and snatched that belt off of a, a legit champion, bro. A champion that had punching power and was knocking dudes out most of his fights. And Devin went up there and made it look easy. He took the belt from him. So it seemed like Shakur a little sour about that, man. See, here's the thing. I like Shakur. But my thing is, hey, Shakur, man, look. See, you see what you see what Devin Haney did in that ring against Regis, a, a power puncher. See, that's how you were supposed to handle Edward De Los Santos. See, you were supposed to handle him like that, and you would get the same praise that should, that Devin's getting right now. You would have got that same attention. All right, so it's not Bill Haney's fault. They picked Regis. Regis had a belt. Dad was moving up anyway. And now Dev is a champion. That quick, just like that. Because they believe in himself. So you didn't believe in yourself, Shakur, in that fight with Edward De Los Santos. That's the reason why you were scared. You were scared of the power. And there's no room for being scared in the hurt business, man. And I love Shakur, man. But I was a little disappointed in that. <clears throat> I expect more from him. And I, I expect more from him in the future. He definitely... Gonna have to show and prove. Cause Devin Haney is the talk of the town right now. Cause he he's actually he's moving his shake in the way a boxer that's a, supposed to. He's balancing now legacy with money. He's not all about leading towards money all the time. He's he's balancing out the bag with the legacy. That's how Shakur's supposed to be moving. On his way to moving, but not. And him and Tank ain't moving right, bro. Shakur's performance slightly put a dent into the, you know, it kind of gave the boxing work, the fans of the boxing, it kind of put a little bit of uh, distrust in, in Shakur Stevenson's performances in the, in, the, in the future, you know. So he going to have to bounce back and bounce back hard and don't play no games with his next opponent. Hopefully they throw him in there with another power puncher. Yeah, that's what I gotta see, right? So instead of Shakur worrying about saying stuff like this, he ready to be getting himself ready for his next fight and and, and actually showing and proving. He ain't gonna be exactly like Devin Haney because they both got different styles, but he's going to have to be more offensive moving forward if he want his career to blossom, you feel me? But this right here, this comic, clearly stated he's pretty much saying that it was a cherry pick bill know how to move dev on the chessboard pretty much what he's saying which i don't believe uh, it was a cherry pick at all i don't believe it was he went up there got the belt off of a real champion he figured i guess tia wouldn't fight him the sabria the Mat matthias a uh, Sabrina Mattia dude. I'm, I'm not sure, you know, um, if they was going to make that happen early on. If anybody reached out to anybody. But, 
you know. Regis was there. Yeah, shout out to Regis because Regis stepped in. He stepped up. He stepped in the ring and decided to take a chance as well. Something that Javante Davis and certain other fighters don't want to do against Dev, right? So you got to give Regis his respect and his props for that. This is how I see it. But we know what you think about this tweet by Shakur Stevenson saying pretty much Bill Haney, goofy ass. You got to give him his credit. He's a smart business, man. <laughs> this dude Shakur just don't stop, man. Anyway, I'm off this. Catch y'all later on the next one, man. And I'm out.